Hey everybody, what is going on? I'm Onitas, Everson5 here, and today I'll be showing you a tutorial on how I make my Matt and David play 1.0.0. Um, some subscribers suggested I should make a tutorial on this, so I will. So what you need is first you need to go get a video clip, so I have it in my Freps directory. So I just go ahead and look for which one. I no longer have my Man David play because I always delete the the raw footage after rendering it out. So uh, I no longer have that, but I can use something like my Hardcore Adventures. So all you have to do is click it and put it inside your little project here. And uh, to place a picture inside your videos, you need to click Import Media. Look for a picture that you would like to put in there. So, for example, I'm going to go get my death counter. So, I have it in my... Uh, here we go. Uh, stuff for YouTube, death counter, and then I have all the numbers. So, I click 18, and then I put it... All you have to do is drag it right here. It will automatically pop itself up here. Then you can make it as long as the video if you want. If you want it in the top left corner forever. And as you can see, it's now right here. For the video, uh, if you would like to resize it or make or put it in a different position, all you have to click is a crop little symbol, and then you come here and if you move it like this, you see here that it is moving. So if you go, you can move it around as you want, and to make it bigger or smaller, you actually just need to go like this, and then this is this is the frame like this F right here. So you need to have it actually in here. You can make it bigger, you can make it smaller, you can do whatever, you can make it look cool. It's Death Counter 18. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much how I do it, guys. And the way I actually make it is you go into Photoshop, you click New, and then you make the width 1280, you make the height 720. Uh, make sure that the background is transparent, then what I do, I use text, I click Chiller, I use the Chiller. Chiller, Chiller, forgot which one it is. I use Bleeding Cowboys now, I don't know why. Um, and then you just write Death Counter 2, for example. And then you just click Save As, and save it as a PNG, because that's what goes best with um, Vegas files, I think. I'm not sure, though. So yeah, that's how I do it, guys, and uh, that's there's nothing more to it. That's all I do. And so whenever I want like a troll face or something, then I just click import media. I find my troll face. Let me find my troll face. Got a bunch of random pictures in here. I'm just going to take this right here. Put it up here. And then I have my human bro in my video. There you go. And there you go, guys. So there's nothing much to it. And, uh... How I do the sound, perhaps you guys don't know how do I do the sound. Uh, it's pretty simple. I have a sound called the Shiny Ding Noise. Um, I found it on YouTube somewhere. Uh, if you guys need the, if you want the link of the sound, then you just you can ask me. But I doubt that you really want that too much. Uh, so I have that here. Let me go get it real quick. Not YouTube assets. Mm, buttholes. <laughs> okay. Um. I'm trying to find what am I doing here? Okay. Death counter, shiny ding noise. Put it accordingly as the video. I mean the picture. There we go. And then you, I just put another picture here. And so if you watch it now. Why would you do that? I cut myself off. I don't know why. Oh yeah. There we go. Speak up behind me again. So that's how you do it guys. Thanks for watching and See you guys in another video. If you want a tutorial on anything else Sony Vegas related or something that you guys might want to know, like my render settings or something, then just ask me. Uh, I already did my render settings video, so if you guys want to check that out, I'll put the link of that in the video if I remember. So anyways, thanks for watching guys, and see you guys later.